Okay, I'll be showing you the swipe keyboard. So I'll go into messaging. Okay, um, these are some SMSs I exchanged with uh, my classmate Sotni. Just show you how the swipe keyboard works here. So basically, you can just say things like hi. Oh, I meant to say hi. Hi. Nope. Hi. Okay, I have fat fingers, that's why. How are you? Okay, if you want to write complicated words, uh, my message is not said because I'm using the data plan. So you want to say something like, maybe commemorate. Commemorate. See, you don't have to be exactly um, specific with the alphabets that you choose. Basically, they recognize the directions of the finger when you, know, when you want to type which alphabets. Like another word can be maybe mesmerize. Mesmerize. Okay, spell with an S. Fine then. Um, a difficult word like just the books. Let's try. Oh, you can have it too. Okay, um, something common like Facebook maybe. You have it too. Okay, to get a double letter, you have to like swivel around the alphabet twice. Okay, and say maybe T O O. Okay, so T O two, or like um keep K E P. Okay, you can even teach the swipe keyboard to recognize new words like um, some Malay words they don't have. I tried a few, which is like sakit, bola, and those are inside already. So uh, I tried jumper, and it just records as jumps. So you can teach it to recognize this new word. J U M P E. Type it once more. Okay, now you can swipe. Jumpa. There you go. Okay, let's make up a word. Um, no, I don't know what word to make up. Furky? Furky? What's for key? I don't know, F U R K Y, fine, let's do it. Fly, fly, doggy, fine. So basically, they recognize oh, exactly like, you know, like what word would form if your fingers go in this direction. So they take into account the alphabets around the area as well. Okay, I didn't mean to say firefly, but. So, so let's teach it to say for key, my new word. Not Fergie, but fur. Oh, only one try and it's already in. See? 